lawyers are caught all the time. Everything's on tape or YouTube right. or your phone. And I think the one area which we're still not getting all the information on until it's too late is when it comes to our kids and their safety and pedophilia. And I think there's got to be a way. And I don't know if it's as a mom, I'm thinking, oh, my, I don't want my kids to have cell phones until later. But this is actually making me think, well, why aren't we arming young children with the ability to record, to then email, to send a text, mm -hmm. to push a button on their sure. phone? In a situation they don't feel safe because, because they're with I, the grown up. We should right. give them the technology that we have that I, we're using to monitor our I, I, that that you know, Hang on, I used to have a quarter when I was little. Okay, it started mm -hmm. when I was really young. It was mm -hmm. a quarter. My mom put nail polish on it. It was red. I knew that quarter was for emergencies only. Or if I was uncomfortable in a situation mm -hmm. I needed help, I knew I could at least go and make a phone call. Mm -hmm. I think, too, with these young kids, we can we have the ability to, in a but wise you know, way, arm a, them was, so that people feel accountable. This is about so accountability. A lot of these Sometimes there can be a feeling amongst moms who are working that they are, you know, they can't do as much as the moms who aren't. And I actually think you're a great team, like the moms who are home with the kids, which I would argue is the most challenging job out it there. Um, and the moms who are working, I think, sure. can have potentially great partnership in schools. Well, but I think as a parent, to that. you but struggle I'm not with that. From a